The game sound is very, very, very loud. <clears throat> the Anyways. Hi there. Welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drive-bys along the way. <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... Uh, hold on, uh, hold on. The streets are safe, you say, but what about the highways? <sighs> I'm, I'm sorry? You heard about the shooting off the Route 1 exit, I trust. Half an hour before any response team arrived on the scene. Over 700 rounds fired in that time. What happened? Where are the... What happened? <laughs> Anyways, what's up guys? Welcome back for more of Cyberpunk on a live stream. So today we are going to rock it up. We're gonna make it all the way up on Cyberpunk. So, um... I'm gonna try to stream as much as I can. Hopefully, it's more than two and three hours. I know that a lot of people stream seven, six hours, but that's because you know some of those streamers are already full time on on this, and I am not. You know, and today I have a free day of my daily job, so I was just like getting into my mind of oh, oh my god, I. I have to, now that I'm done with the Lost Judgment series, I have to um, be going with with the Cyberpunk series, so... Okay, please, 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 I'm doing an introduction here, can't you tell? Okay, anyways, <clears throat> oh, let's see. anyways, uh, welcome back guys so if you do of course like this like and love the series of lost judgment as much as i did well uh, i'm if you want to see more of course we're gonna jump in on the cyberpunk so if you do like the video of the stream like the video thumbs it up and of course if you are part of um this channel and you're a subscriber um i do wanna thank you so much for the support Thank you so much for the love and not to mention that for the new people that are on this channel i would like to give me a, I, oh, sorry i would like you to give me a chance to show you how great is this channel right guys right you know they the, the guys over there that are subscribers know about this anyways thank you so much for the love and for those that are new do like the video do comment anything that is positive or negative is welcome all the time and of course subscribe to the channel and ring the bell you guys thank you so much and here we go we're gonna keep going on the series of cyberpunk i'm gonna see all it says that open your inventory and put some clothes okay find some but i mean i'm gonna change uh, the camera so you guys can watch a little bit uh, wait a minute so I need to change the sight of the camera I'll try to move it over there okay so leave the apartment open your inventory and put on some clothes is optional find something to eat optional check your mail option so find something to eat I'm gonna take a shower of course something to eat check your mail is optional Let's see dear sir madam our record show me the show we have not received this month's rent payment for your unit mega building h10 in accordance with the tendency agreement, 
any subsequent payment delay will result in a forced eviction from the property. Okay. Open your inventory and put on some clothes. Oh my god, I didn't have any clothes? do that because i am the one who saved your life haven't managed to get my head straight yet not after everything that happened that will not happen anytime soon and so what if you intend to leave you must re-enter the ring the bell has already told thomas diner i am waiting okay let me change some things, okay? Ooh, ooh. I like that vest. Holy sh But I do not like that one. But I had that I don't like it. Got some pants, the one that we have is okay. No, no, no. There's nothing new. As a corporal, I guess the only thing that we can use right now is this. I like the vest. Gonna go me with Takemura. Seems like we haven't paid rent yet. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. PD, open up. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Read the message from the mega builder. Right. Understood. Got it. Sure. Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Quitting Night City is not as easy as you think. Sort of like an abusive relationship, huh? Listen, uh, I could use a little flow to the old pocket. Want to peek at some fresh gear? Sure. Let me see what you got. I mean, but we got really good pistols right now. Should we even bother? Oh, this one looks nice. But I don't have... I mean, you, you, you have more money than me, buddy. What, you, what do you want me to say? How about me selling to you stuff? How about that? Power light machine gun and gun like this. Let's trade. Nope. Nope. Maybe. I have this currently equipped. Why should I have this one currently equipped? I think he wanted me to buy and then instead I ripped him off 
by buying by selling my skin. Same. Can I do target practice? It says I cannot do target practice. Let me see if I can actually equip my stuff. Yeah. I have a great gun. This oh shoot. That's such a great gun. I I would like to buy the bat. The baseball bat, but Okay, this one is good. We're not going to move with the perks yet. I mean, I like um, still what I'm supposed to build, and I still don't know what I want. So we gotta hold it. Uh, read the message from the Mega Builders. Oh, inside it he looks that, like it's super dark. Now we're going outside. And it is. Halt has also announced plans to run for mayor. Just another election. Today. So, uh, are we going to talk about yesterday? God. You know, in this kind of neighborhood, like this kind of stuff, when it happens, it seems like you can know this small circle, you can know the people that is around you. I guess you have that advantage. Can we call the car? Looks like it's alive. What? what? There's kids? There's small kids NPCs running around, man. Eh? That's you in a good game. A fixer just sent you an offer to buy a vehicle. Whenever you receive an offer, a new marker will appear on your minimap. To buy the vehicle, go to the indicator location and confirm your purchase. <laughs> Some gigs, we got cyber psycho sighting neutralize the threat. Okay, seems like oh, Regina Jones. We got some gigs that we didn't do. Where's the where's the thing that she was telling? Okay. Pay your debt on full to Victor. B is the one have a major Okay, so we should do some some of these, right? We should do some cycles to uh, get a little bit of extra cash and not to mention that we need these um, extra things of our settings to build our character. Sit. Well, I was going you to do say not anyway, look so bad. Then in the car. I doubt it you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? 
I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. That doesn't cut it. That doesn't answer the question. This is about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Then just answered, answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable Did about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. I am an enigma to be sure. I am but just she showed you. that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out lumped with the outcasts easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Wait a minute.
There's no time to waste, B. Okay, better be going. Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are uh, its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. Untrue. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you. Well, seems things are going to suck as scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. The last thing we want to do is draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan. Organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is What's that good? you do not so, leave man? the city. Hello, leave. buddy. How you doing? Why would I leave? Need Stop. help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No It's been good. It's been good. How, how about you? Actually, we just talked about doing, some. Man? Well, I got. We gotta still try. B? With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. Actually, There's just I heard honor, that myself I believe. On, on You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. 
If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Defected? Where to? Some other corp poach him? As far as I can tell, he acted alone. A meticulous man. He planned it. Covered his tracks very well. Any okay. idea where he took off to? None. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. There's no Meaning time to waste, B. for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind to most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. Thank you. Couldn't expect less. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Helma, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Hey, at least you so have then, friends. I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Yeah? Okay. What the hell? Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. <laughs> hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again? Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. I don't like, um... By the way, I don't like Keanu's alternate um, custom um, like a skin or or clothing that I gave him. Let's go with the original, right? Let's go try to see the original one. I think it's much better. I just tried the alternate. Because I wanna I wanted to see how it looked like. But 
I'm not being a fan about it. Johnny Silver. Default. Welcome back. My guest tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. I like when you go back and then you can literally see the radio. I mean, hear the radio, sorry. So find oh. every at least his bar. You hmm. can try that. Lisa's bar talks to the cops. These are some geeks. Another side job. And this one. Um. There's a problem. I need a car. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I guess I'm going all to the end of this. I'll do anything. my marker go? Where's my ping on the map? Switch the camera. Hey, hard look. to drive it like this. Call duty. It's optional too. not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me, too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? before again got a good memory for faces we're closed right now looking for Evelyn Parker know where I might find her used to come around haven't seen her in a while though need to talk to punch and Judy she in her den yep take the stairs down I'll let Judy know you're coming. Okay. Whoa, whoa, start again. I thought you guys said you were close. Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know what he's saying. I don't care. I just want my room back. Judy's embarrassing herself. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back here. Why? Chill. 
Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You're so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Bad day. Whoa. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that... What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on her. Wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower? <laughs> Luxurious. Wait. So. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Give you a call. Okay. Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. Well, I don't need to talk to you right now. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. Cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Hey, look. What? They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. I don't see it. Okay, sure. My bad. So go to the mega building. Okay. Sorry, sorry, excuse me, I'm gonna in a very hurry, I'm going all GTA 5 right now. Let's see. There's some icons going up on the top of my right on the map. I wonder what are those. Some pop and then they just leave the side of my map. Kako Okada, the Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then.
way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence, we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. I mean, yeah, but. St. Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Honestly, what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. That's better. Oh, hold on. You take a blow up doll, remodel. New job, get on that. That's cheap. That's infidelity. Sit on wait until the years now. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. You Would you care to jack into the terminal? Uh, looking for an Evelyn, Evelyn Parker. Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. What you mean? The algorithm available. knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Check in, please. Huh. <sighs> I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Oh. Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. There's one called Rain. Okay, so he's Sky and Angel. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or... Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. Five the entire years. floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, uh -huh. Johnny. We hope you enjoy your stay. What a 
guess that makes you a real deity. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Valerie. What? Just me. Being. Just me. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. What? How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Okay. There's something in those mirrors way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Um, what is that? Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why'd the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything? Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. Okay. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. Come to terms. Sure, let me just curl up on the floor and wait for... <laughs> whatever. Give up. That's what you're saying. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world this to know like I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? The people I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change, that thought alone could save your life. I think I might just be... afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of... the void. Because that's about what greeted me before. Fear is your most effective weapon in the fight against death. <sighs> so what now? Now, you find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you 
while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. Okay. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single Imagine thing, this thing in this world in the future are real isn't robots. in the process of becoming something else. Like Likewise, robots you going just in never this field, even look on back. therapy or whatever and it, it works. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it Thanks. burn. Uh, for all this, jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Damn, it's like super deep. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk. You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. But this was different, refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here, come back. I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat. But she could be in trouble. Just wanted to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out. And maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? I'm supposed to VIP know that area. She's so Booth about two, I think. <coughs> Thanks. See. You turned out to be useful after all. Not bad. But I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you, here, now! You got any idea who I am? Problem. This gonk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. No shortage of wise asses. I'll see. Going back upstairs? Get to piss first. Yeah. I kind of jack in. See what's going to be there? Maybe I can. Buddy. 
Let's try not to kill him so we don't have to do something bad. There's a katana. That was not what I'm supposed to do right now. Stop looking. Oh no. Am I wearing? Access granted. What will you have? Anything? You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hi! Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Okay. Woodman. Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Are you okay, buddy? Are you okay?
Tiger Claw's mean like his peeping toms. Always got eyes on their dolls. Know what goes on in these booths. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. So that... Had a hunch? Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying? schedule okay Whoa. no clients allowed in here Dear, and close the door on the way out, would ya? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Yeah. Well, Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her bill or bow before. But go on. I'm listening. You sit here in this dank hole you probably call your office and think you've got it made, don't you? Congrats! You read minds better than our own fucking AI. Someone get this girl a job. Ever stop to think who's behind the Tiger Claw puppets you call your bosses? Tiger Claw bosses have got their own bosses, case you didn't know. You're just too small to see them. Oh, because you're such a big shot. Yeah. Let's just say, a certain member of the Arasaka clan wouldn't be pleased if he knew something bad happened to Evelyn, and that you're the one responsible. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker? She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. This you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know a last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Want to find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co ed's wet dream.
You may take your weapons. Katana seems good. Which is good. An SMG and then a shotgun. A pleasant day to you. The next I wish time I had like a sniper. Cloud, don't wait. Are there snipers though? I hope there are snipers. Got a real charm this place. In that slimy subterranean kind of way. Think Fingers is gone, her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. See, her opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed? Oh, but it has. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. To what? Did he just say I forgot speed on him? How to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See me and Arasaka. We got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Everyone Listen, honored, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my ship problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Oh, bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. 
Feeling a bit better now, so scram. Got something that important needs to One be. last thing. Alt Cunningham. She's the ace up my sleeve. Oh, fuck off. Tired of hearing your voice. Don't blame you. But you'll hear me yet. And don't get killed in the meantime, will ya? Promised I'd call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. Gotta go. I didn't know why I did that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Press some other button and then it flipped on getting the, the grenade and and I was gonna cancel I didn't I couldn't cancel and then I just throw it. Uh, I'm so sorry. Today doesn't seem like the day to. The hell's that? No, no, damn it. Jesus, the fu it's all going too slow. I'm gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. You said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live ready. now. What the hell do you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Everyone Listen, honored, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so this Makoshi. What is it, exactly? Okay, base six. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now. Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Come on, come on, you got more to say, so just say it. Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You, yours, me, mine. Feeling a bit better now, so scram. Got something that important needs to be. One last thing. Alt Cunningham. She's the ace up my sleeve. Oh, fuck off. Tired of hearing your voice. Don't blame you. But you'll hear me yet. And don't get killed in the meantime, will ya? This is what I wanted to do. 
and then I clicked the wrong one and I was going to cancel on it. Like that. I take a bite. <laughs> of what? Oof. I mean, you're coughing on the food. I guess not. Well, we need the pipe fixed, that's for sure. We need something to fix up some of the things. B. You called. <laughs> Promised I'd call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently, they carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. Oh, shit. Heading there now to find her. There's no body in the park. I told her to stay the fuck away from Clouds. I knew oh, that right, part. literally. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how, exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced, but it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meet and when? Japan Town. After sunset, I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. What you looking at? So all these residents... The name is what? Holy, what a huge guy. Dark eating no good bastard son of a bitch. Stop right there. What? Oh, hey, honey. Hey, honey. What the fuck? What are you doing here? Oh. Sunshine. Shh, shh. Don't want any drama now. She got caught or something? <laughs> Too late. What do you think? Okay. Here, kitty, kitty, what's the rush? Yeah. 
Did you just call me Kitty? Don't ever do that again. I tipped you for free. Fuck off! Yeah? Gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Nada? Not even installments? Like I said, he just finished and said, see you next time. Mm -hmm. Well, well, what do we got here? And you just the cutest thing. If you're looking for a release, I just might be your man. Be an if you expect any got an issue needs sorting out. Here to do that. So how about you fuck off, let me through, and no one will be the wiser. So serious from the get-go? I was only joking. Sheesh. Fine. Let her through, sludge. Financial claim? Take it to court, you Fuck pussy. Up and leave me be. V, right, hey. I get it. Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me. And you come off the Hello! There's a line. Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down Glad and waste to see your turn. Face. I'm worried sick about her, V. Had no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell did she go back to Cloud? <sighs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docs in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. Um. Fingers. Where will I find him? He's operating on somebody right now. Been in there for ages. Shouldn't be much longer. Don't hold your breath. I spent hours waiting for him to come out. Especially when he collects payment right after the procedure. <laughs> My friend here, she's in really sorry shape. Couldn't let us cut in front just this once. Uh, uh. Of course, honey, be my guest. Well, now hold on, hold on a sec. Didn't seem so bad just a minute ago. She's a toughie. Keeps it inside, mostly. Now try to open Come on, let's go. Hmm. How about now? Better. Wait, something's wrong. Can't see nothing but a blur. Faceplate's previous owner had a longer face than you. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes I think he's adjust. done. We're going in. Eventually. Yes? Hello. What can I do for you? Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? Shame. Could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours. Days. <laughs> But I'm busy right now. You, Tiger Claws? Far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? 
What do you two want? Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. I'll be more than glad to show you around, but, um, uh, later, perhaps. Sure. Of course. I Suggest can't... you start remembering all you can. Either that, or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Want details, damn it! Name the studio! They mentioned a moth, of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. That's for being a scumbag. And a reaper. Well, ladies, seems like he's gonna take a while. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Losing our cool won't do us any favors. It's a waste of time. Oh, I'm cool. Real fucking cool with the fact that Ev's probably already dead. You don't know that. And I'm sure as hell not gonna squander precious minutes we could spend looking. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Okay. Let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. How can I change?
we're supposed to get access. Okay, it's going to be hot. I cannot do anything else. Oh, I can. Oh, I can log in. Okay. So, one C. Consider inventing a purchasing niche for yourself or a loved one. Get in touch with administration at North Oak Home Gardens. <laughs> Something raw, untouched. I'll come back some other time. Betting on it. How about you? You're buying or just gonna stand there like a pig undercover? What have you got? Virtues. Any special kind? Well, let me put it to you this way those who know don't need to ask. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs for what you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Got anything that might interest me? Is this the one? Uh, Two thousand, three thousand. Is this one? Pleasure doing biz with you. I wonder if I can kill them. Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. My catch from <laughs> Scav, gotta be. No one else with that kind of fashion sense. Ordered recently. <laughs> Electric cork patch on the coveralls. Christ, it's hot. Thermal readings are off the charts. Keep looking. Coveralls had a patch on him. Electric corp. Hmm. 
Could be a costume. A prop? Factory worker fetish? Hard as hell to believe. Hmm. It'd explain the higher thermal readings, too. You could be onto something. Heard shit like that before. Sounds like scabs to me. Woman. Who knew that sides chopping people up, they were scrolling XBDs? Can't beat that rich synth cough aroma. Cheap shit. Cold, too. Mm hmm. Buck a slice. Ordinary box. Decker, Tanaka, and Rogers logo. Standard for a trash heap. Co okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a buck a slice. So, EC used Means to someone's grabbing buck a slice regularly, which is not something one does for the flavor too. and fresh ingredients. How can you be sure, though? Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna schlep across town for it. Here we go. Old electric core power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with that for now. And then I'll to garner from this floor. We did something about it, right? No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me. Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the death said moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. They'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. Let's keep the ride. And here we are. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet. See if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. All right, going in.
Time to creep around. Be there in a sec. Try to find a way to the lower level. That's the only thing that I can say.
force it open. Hmm. How about now? Found a way down. You see my position? Yep, be there in a sec. Wait for me. V, hold up. I'm close. I'm here. We need to get to level minus two. Bet that's where they're keeping her. Hear that? We don't have enough methionine for the base of batch. Relax. Come out quick.
Duffers. Classic. Can't go wrong. These are solid steel. Not the so- Even if you come here on your own, gunning to become a star, there's no guarantee you're ever getting out. out all her implants. And why stop there? Took a few internal organs while they were at it. How so very resourceful. Scabs. No matter how many you stamp out, there'll always be more crawling around somewhere. Figure you've made their acquaintance. Afraid so. like piss on a rotting corpse. Close to the studio, I think. You find anything useful? Read up the elevator. It should be easier to get out of here. Fuck! Go side! You don't fuck around, do you? Wait one sec for me. Come out, you pussy! I'm here. Let's find her. Hang in there.
That's Evelyn. Just don't touch her. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. I see her. Cable two. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. All right, let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And... Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. I think she's not even Which way? in the position to answer. So. I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. No time to lose, V. Gotta get her out of here. Okay, so why did you go to the right? Like, you confused me. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? For fuck's sake, V. Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Ah, oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell me you don't feel it, too. We going in? I usually don't do it, but... What's there to wait for? Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of a door. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. You're mad at her. Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any... I know. It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look... Hey. How you feeling? Need anything? Not here to nag. Just talk. <laughs> well now, look at you. I need to get the information. Have a seat. Okay. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage him in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy. But I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? Okay. What am I looking out for? Take a look around if you want. <sighs> I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys. But that's just a hunch. 
Can't be 100% sure. The spine-chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find, because they don't want to be. Or I wouldn't know where to start. Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the Virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait bourri. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, uh, should I... Yeah, just... not be important. Maybe, but all of them are from Pacifica. Narrows down our search, at least. For... Uh, should I... Bioship? Where you hear this? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. You spin the virtue, then in the virtue, you come back. Can't see her face. Under normal circumstances, that encryption is easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. All right, think we got everything. So bad for going to a place that in the end. What do you think? Come on. Woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... Ugh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. Pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Oui, we are going to take a reason to be too intelligent to protect you. We are not going to be C'est le plus bon moyen de nous gagner pour nous arriver sur le monde. Il faut que nous puissions faire cela. Vous gagnez un plus bon leader? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon critique et ça me pense, continuez à faire le travail. Vous pouvez avoir fait une fin de ce que vous Quelle langue est-ce que vous parlez? I don't know. Haitian Creole. It is the voodoo boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Got it. Give it a second. We have to know what they're saying. Could be important. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. So it's is our best route to Yorinobu, and we must take this risk. You want Yorinobu. I wish I showed you confidence that silver hand leaders too. Okay. 
We don't question my judgment. We can go back to the city. You decide to be a point I'll continue to do the work. Okay, Judy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, you got any idea? Biochip we stole? It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. <laughs> Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, uh. Know who they are, who the woman is? Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Doesn't seem easy. Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Evelyn could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Yeah. Anyways... I'm gonna leave it for now on um, the episode here. There you go. It's gonna save. So I'm gonna leave it for now, guys. In the stream in here. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for being part of the series of the Cyberpunk with the live stream. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna try to see a little bit of more of the game, even going for the side quest. And well, I hope that. Uh, the game so far has been good for me it's a little bit uh, confusing some things because it's so cybernetic so like with the internet and all that kind of stuff but we'll try our best to catch up and see what is all this information that they're giving us so thank you so much give it a like thumbs it up of course comment on the video if you can anything good anything bad doesn't matter you know I'll still read the comments and of course uh, if you're new to the channel and if you want to subscribe to the channel be of course positive that I will be in the future keep doing a lot of um, streams and a lot of content on my channel so thank you so much subscribe comment and ring the bell and of course thumbs it up if you did think that it was good thank you so much see you in the next one bye, -bye.